Hello, this is Dr. Turkmani, consultant in cornea and cataract surgery, and in this video I'm going to present uh, a few modifications uh, that I do uh, when harvesting a bomb layer uh, graft. Uh, this is uh, basically quite similar to the original technique, but I think that these few modifications help me to uh, be more successful on getting a nice uh, graft. I'm not trying to say that this way is uh, better or worse or equal to the original technique but simply that this works uh, best uh, for me so initially I start uh, as per the original technique uh, I remove the epithelium from the cornea and I do a gentle uh, scoring with a 30 gauge needle trying to make it very superficial so that uh, I don't go uh, into the deeper layers of uh, uh, the superficial stroma and I continue doing the scoring 360 degrees as per the original technique At this point, this is my first uh, modification. Rather than uh, straight away trying to grab and peel with a McPherson's forceps, what I do is I do those uh, gentle uh, strokes, uh, let's say, or uh, scraping movements uh, with just one uh, arm of the McPherson forceps to try and lift uh, Bowman uh, alone. So in case I have scored a little bit deeper than uh, just uh, Bowman, I can make sure that still I can separate um, a nice uh, flap of uh, bomber layer uh, alone uh, which I can later on uh, grab and peel this is the second modification when I have lifted a nice uh, flap let's say 360 degrees as soon as I can I switch to a uh, more fields uh, forceps because it gives me a, a greater area of uh, grip rather than just a uh, point of tension uh, with the McPherson's I get an area of uh, grip which uh, I think it helps to reduce the uh, likelihood of uh, tearing the tissue uh, because the tension is spread over an area every now and then I would moist the tissue uh, put it back explore for micro tears uh, in the periphery and then continue doing the same over and over again uh, please notice uh, that I'm putting the Morpheus forceps uh, sideways so the area of contact is uh, even bigger uh, at this point I have identified the micro tear so if I just insist on grabbing and pulling I'll just make the uh, micro tear bigger so what I do I just manually dissect uh, around it with uh, a manual dissector and uh, when I've uh, overcome that micro tear I just continue grabbing and pulling with my Moorfields uh, forceps 360 degrees over and over again uh, and uh, you can see in this video that uh, I'm not lifting when I uh, pull bomb and layer I'm grabbing and pulling but I'm also pressing down with the tip of the forceps onto the rest of the uh, strom of the donor cornea so that I reduce the tension over bomb and layer uh, when the uh, full uh, layer has been peeled off uh, the rest of the procedure is uh, as per the original technique I uh, expand it again, explore it, stain it with uh, vision blue and refine it to, to the desired uh, size in this case it was an 8 uh, millimeter graft and then put the tissue in BSS and see a nice uh, bone scroll which now is uh, ready for transplantation. I hope you enjoy this uh, video. Thank you very much.